Well, of course, the heart of the Christian faith is that these elemental forces you're talking about embodied themselves in a human being and recon reconciling mankind to God. Yes, and the uh, basic Buddhist idea is that that is true of you as well. And that what Jesus was was a person who realized that in himself and lived out of the Christhood of his nature. What do you think about Jesus? We just don't know. Jesus. All we know are four contradictory texts that tell us what he did. Written many years after he lived. But I think we know what Jesus said. I think the, the sayings of Jesus are, are probably pretty close. But when you read the Thomas Gospel, the Gospel according to Thomas, which was dug up there in that, uh, with those other uh, Gnostic texts, it has all the flavor of one of the uh, synoptics, Matthew, Mark, or Luke, except that it doesn't say quite the same thing. Uh, there's one wonderful passage. It's the last one in the, in the gospel, actually. Uh, when will the kingdom come? Now, in Mark 13, I think it is, we hear that the end of the world is going to come. That's to say, a mythological image, that's the end of the world, is taken as a reference to an actual physical historical fact to be. When you read the Thomas Gospel, Jesus says the kingdom of the Father will not come by expectation. The kingdom of the Father is spread upon the earth and men do not see it. So I look at you now in that sense and the radiance of the presence of the divine is known to me through you. Through me? You, sure. A journalist? Jesus also says in this text, he who drinks from my mouth will become as I am and I shall be he. He's talking from the point of view of that being of beings which we call the Christ, who is the being of all of us. And anyone who lives in relation to that is as Christ. And anyone who incarnates, or rather brings into his life the message of the word, is equivalent to Jesus. That's the sense there. That. So that's what you mean when you say, I am radiating God to you. You are, yes. And you to me. And I'm sp speaking this seriously. No, no, I take yes. it seriously. I, I happen to believe the same as you without being able to articulate it as you do. I do sense that there is divinity. The divinity is in the other. So you are the vehicle. You are, as it were, a radiant of the spirit. And that's why not recognize it.